si Bakla, sabi, Lala Bells daw siya. Parang, Pero kung uh, si Just Bigat kumain, gago. Sabi ni San, si CR lang daw siya. Bakit ka kumain? Pero bakit si Bakla kumain? Bakit kumain? Ayun nga. Gulo nga usap ng Bakla. <laughs> ano na? <laughs> si Bakla. Diyos ko. <laughs> <laughs> Napakahayo. Bakit kasi? Ah, ah, ah. si CR. Si Bakla. Mali ang intindi. Kaya nga. Sabi si CR lang. <laughs> Isang oras ba yun? Nakakatalaga. <laughs> <laughs> Ano ba ito sa'yo bakala po? Tanginang po. Alam. Ano ba na yun? Alam, promise. Gago talaga. Sabi ko si CR lang ito. <laughs> Oo. Iba yung intindi niya. Nakakala, <laughs> e-air na ka. <laughs> Oo. Oh, Hayop na ito. So, wala. Tapos sa itong page na ito, nakaka-recording pa lang. Ah. Tira mo, sabi ko, bukas na. Nag... Ay, putang ina, siguro bukas na ang sinabi ko ni Akala. Ang buka naman ko. Tawaga mo na, be. <laughs> Hindi niya na iintindihan mo. Ano siya? Natatanga ako sa'yo, bakala. <laughs> bakala, asa lang. Mm. Bakala, wag niyo iniiba ng brain cells, ha? <laughs> Ikakabit mo siya. <laughs> <laughs> Baka akala nyo sinabi po bu- Bukas na eh, bukas na Tapos... Diba? Si CR ka lang eh Tapos bukas na <laughs> Di Sana bukas na lang natin ituloy Oo, oh, oh. so so Lord, Di sabasagot si Bakla na telepono Ah, natitrigger ako <laughs> <laughs> Ang bobo. Nabobobohan ako, Fred. Ba't ganun? Umiikli ang pasensya ko dito sa bakla. Wala lang outtakes to. <laughs> Ay, ang bukas na. Nakakaloka. Ano yung tapos? A few moments. So, An hour later. Later. <laughs> 16 paranoia few days later. This is a Cup of Coffee Podcast. Ano nangyari? Okay ka lang? Nangihina kasi ako. Oh, nag... Alam mo ba, hindi pa ako tinatantara ng gano'n, ng breakout ko. Laging dito siya sa location na to. Hindi ko alam kung bakit. Hindi kaya dahil sa mask? Siguro. Herpes. Tsara. <laughs> Diyos ko. Bakit? Buti ka ah. na breakout lang. Ako acne. Kasi talagang, eh, hindi siya talagang, dalawang buwan na siyang ganyan. Diyan lang siya sa location na to. As in, hindi siya lum- umaalis. Nag-open ka pa ng camera. Ayan, oo. Oh. Dito, mother, anong tawag nito? Parang something um, intestinal. Talaga ba? Pag dyan yung, yung area ng ano. Eh di sana matagal na kasi mayroon naman akong issue talaga sa intestines ko. <laughs> Baka ngayon lang, ano, naka-penetrate. Then, <laughs> Hanggang doon, maka-penetrate. Nakakabalita. <laughs> <laughs> o, oh, fuck. Fuck. Mm-mm. Ano balita? Ano balita sa inyo? How's everyone doing? So, who likes who? <laughs> I'm sorry. Well, first, <laughs> welcome back to a Coffee Coffee Podcast. And, of course, we are still here with my coffee bodies. We have Jazz. Hi, Jazz. Hello! Oh! Ayan, more, 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 wala kang audio, baka napuputol-puro kang pocket ka. Harapin mo yung headset mo! Hindi ko mahal. Huwag lang speaker nila kaya. Ayan, kaya bakla, nilalamon siya ng video. Ayan. Ayan. Karinig mo kami, ha? Pero hindi ko kayo rinig. Ay! Minus 10 ka talaga dahil, oi. Ayan, piste, yan naman pala. Okay ka na? 
Welcome back to the real world. <laughs> Lutang. <laughs> Lutang. Ako nga din, Lutang din ako. Ate, alam mo ba, so, this more, this noon, sus ko dahil, 20,000 na grocery item na naman ako dahil. Nasa 25,000 na ginasas ko kanila para sa grocery. Sus ko. Tapos yung nails ko, hindi pa ayos. <laughs> Naka-press on nails lang ako. <laughs> Kada yung ano, ganun lang. Kat 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 lang ganun. Correct. Ito, Correct. Ito, Correct. Ito, how are you? Konnichiwa, Minasan. Ako ay nakabili na. Gaming chair. Oo nga eh, gaming chair. Sabay tayo yung gaming chair ko. Sheet. Yung gaming chair ko, hanggang kayo nagpapaalam pa rin siya. Ayaw niya talaga. Bakit? Eh, papaalas ko pa yung hydraulics. Sa sira kasi yung hydraulics, hindi siya, kumbaga par, hindi siya ba yung, hindi, hindi oh. siya gumaganon. <laughs> Gumano na siya ng tuluyan. <laughs> Alam mo yun? Baka kasi naman iba yung binaro. I love it. Mas gagawin ka. Hindi kasi diba para merong wheel sa ilalim, diba? Yes, exactly. Mm. Tapos yung, yung parang may isusok sa siyang ganon. Oo, yes, yung kasunod siya. na ano. Hindi ko na siya masuksok. Hindi ko na siya masuksok. Sikip na siya. Oh? Sa mga kaliktad. I personally don't <laughs> believe. <laughs> ano yung 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 Yeah, so parang hindi ko nga alam para so ipapaayos ko pa siya. I'm looking for a man who can, you know. A man. <laughs> well, because a woman won't be able to. <laughs> Mabigat. Uh, not, not unless. Well, oy, marunong siya. Feminism, feminism. <laughs> oh, diba? Pari mo marunong si ate girl. Diba? Pero hindi hmm. usually, diba, lalaki naman ang gumagawa. Yung mga nasa sa mga, ang tawag dito, nasa mga... Anong meron at nga naka-open ka mga mga bakla? <laughs> Paano ko kayo yun? Ito ko alam. Ay, ako lang. Lagi na wala ako naka-open cam. Hindi <laughs> ko rin alam. Wala. May wala. Kasi parang feeling ko ang ganda-ganda ko today. Ay! Push mo. Sana Push mo yan. Push mo yan. Smiley lang ako. Patiting kayo lang ako. <laughs> wala lang. Pati, well, maiba lang. Pati ganun. Um, ano mo sabihin ko? Ewan ko ba? Anyway, so, okay. in today's episode, ang, ha- ang, taga- ang haba ng intro natin, pero in today's episode kasi, um, we kind of like mentioned it the last episode that we did, which is toxic femininity, but right now, is all about the wo- the uh, the woke culture, which is, um, until now, I am struggling and not understanding what it's all about. According to my friend Google, what culture is associated with the min- bleh, the millennial generation. The term spread internationally and was added to the Oxford Dictionary in 2017. The terms woke washing and woke capitalism were coined to describe companies who signal support for pre- for progressive causes a substitute for a genuine change. I was reading that and I have no idea what they were talking about. <laughs> so, in your understanding, ikaw, Tensiko, ano yung pagkakaitindihan mo sa, pagkakaitindi mo sa book culture? Well, technically, it's like people trying to say, oh, that's parang similar na siya din sa previous topic natin. People trying to say, this is the only thing that's right. You've been doing shit wrong. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. The mindset that mm-hmm. we used to have that um, like for example, nga, femininity. Uh, I mean, yeah, um, what is it? Para, para, so, tarahan natin. Ilang beses mag, eh, magaganon, mag, 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 Yo ano, iba yung uh, toxic femininity, masculinity na ang dating is um you should not be um hindi mo dapat ikakahon lang na doon lang siya uh-huh. na dapat um kung ano yung it's it's not good to pag pag masculine ka kailangan din iyak, kailangan hindi ka magsi-show ng emotion. So, parang yun yung dating ng toxic masculinity. They're expecting things. So, parang, ito nga yun, ganun yung tao. Oo, oh, oo, oh, oo. Oh. Hindi man natin pwedeng sabihin na mali siya lagi. Parang din sa toxic femininity na um, like yung sinasabi natin yung last week na eh kung gusto ni ate na pinagsisid ba yung asawa niya? 
Wala mm-hmm. tayo magagawa doon. Totoo. Doon siya masaya. Mm-hmm. Eh, yung, kasi meron din ako nakita sa Reddit na si ate is um, yun talaga yung parang trend na gusto nilang gawin as women. Ang tawag nila is trad women. So, trad is. wife. Trad wife. Traditional yung, yung, ano, wife. Okay. Traditional wife, traditional women. Ah. Yung parang they want to serve. My husband is a mechanic. So, when he comes home, um, he doesn't have to do anything. I do everything kasi ako yung wife. Pero, si kuya, tumutulong din naman pag mm-hmm. kaya niya. Which is great. Pero he doesn't have to. Mm-hmm. Yun yung magandang dynamic doon. I mean, you cannot, yun nga, hindi natin pa inikahon na doon lang, di ba? Na, ay, babae ka, dapat hindi mo, ano, you have to be empowered. And, okay, that's fine to be empowered. Pero, Relationships are give and take. If they want to do it, then do it. If they don't want to, mm-hmm. let them do their shit. Because there's always room, room for, for everybody. Let's <laughs> just say that. Read <laughs> that. Here again. Anyways, it goes just. What? How do you? What do you think of about? Para after listening to Tenshi, parang sabi ko parang mali yung pagkakaintindi ng kanang pawo kasi. What I understand is pawok are those people na trying to um, show a front. Mm-hmm. Ina ano um ibang iba sa totoong pagkatao nila na so mm-hmm. they try to be um, dominating or the, the leader type or the alpha type pero hindi mm-hmm. naman pala yun yung ano mm-hmm. that's how I understood um, pawok. Uh-huh. Well, because bigla na gimbalot ako. <laughs> so actually um. Woke culture came from the idea of these millennials. Na parang um, yung old ways. Para pag, pag alibawa, for example, uh, uh, let's go to your example, Tenshi ko. No, na for example, yung ang um, babae dapat lang nagluluto, lalaki dapat ang katrabaho, stuff like that. And then the millennials will say, "That's not how it works. Wake up, wake the fuck up." So that's where woke came up. Mm-hmm. Like, okay, now that we know, we're not gonna stand aside, and we're gonna practice now the new thing, which is equality. Those are the fundamental of woke culture, which is it's time to wake up. That that old traditional things are not working anymore. Wake up. This is what's happening right now. That's woke. However, mayroong parang tendency that these people that says that they are woke, mga self-righteous naman ang dating. Yeah. Right? This, again, I, I kind of understand where the woke culture comes from because yes, other there are other things in the past, our traditions, that doesn't work anymore. Hence, we need to wake up Hence, we need to change it up for us, for you know, for the new generation. Like for example, um, may mga schools. Like, I'm I'm really happy. Like for example, in this in Batangas City, there's this university. I'm not gonna name the name. Um, dalawa siyang university ha. Yung university ko at yung kabilang university. Yung university ko, they were traditional. All gay men needs to be wearing this. Needs to be wearing that. Doon sa kabilang university, pag transgender ka na, you are allowed to wear the the, the female, female uniform. So, and this was like what? Ni- the 1990s. So, Ooh. We, Ooh. we were woke already by that time. Clearly. Mm-mm. So, parang ang sa akin lang, parang, okay, now that you are, um, Now that the other schools are okay, ay dapat pala ganun talaga. So we can welcome other the, the community properly and be, you know, respectable with other, you know, with other um uh, preferences, should I say. So that's woke culture. However, now okay naman yung pagka woke na parang um yung mga pa, now na pinagbigyan na nga sila na okay na yung uniform and stuff like that. Ngayon yung pagpipilita naman nila, dapat may sarili silang CR. May, sabi ko, eh, isa-isa lang, one thing at a time. Because there are times that, you know, being woke is not an excuse to be pushy and to be 
pushing your agenda to other people because the other people might not be welcoming the inform the ganon the change right so ikaw jazz what are the things that you've experienced na parang eh, eh, mas mag- mas luma yung mas maganda yung lumang tradition kasi sa ngayon kasi nakikita nga natin di ba yung woke culture they're literally killing off old tradition <coughs> mm, um siguro I'll go back sa sa pagde-decorate ng cake The, the new uh, breeds of ano, sige, decorators, parang lahat, uh, they buy na lang the instants. Yo. Tapos yun, instant? yun. Like, for example, you can buy na ba na nakadarap ko na yung fondant, ready-made. Ay, ready to oh. use. Yeah. Ooh. Samantalang, hanggang ngayon, ako nagtitimbang pa rin hanggang Kasi sa huling patas. Kasi mahirap gawin, diba? Mahirap, yeah. it's tricky. Very tricky. Kaya, kahit anong gawing gaya nila, kahit anong gawing lesson nila, hindi nila makukuha kasi I still stick with the, the olden um, methods. Eh sila, yun, yung mga problems sila, bakit nagka-crack agad-agad, ganyan. Eh ako, hindi, be, talagang mano-mano lahat yan up to the last. Ano, kaya, yan din yung explanation ko. Oh, ngayon, they had their time na sila yung mabenta kasi they can sell their uh, cakes cheap. So we suffered. Pero ngayon, sila naman ngayon, binibenta na nila yung mga gamit nila sa amin ngayon kasi nalugi sila. True. Kasi nga yung quality. Yung quality. Yung quality nakalimutan nila eh. Kasi we get complaints na bakit yung kay ganito, pag slice mo, sumabog yung cake. Sabi ko, hindi naman po pulburon ang tinitinda ko. So hindi siya sasabog. So, um, there's this article, um, well actually, there's um, this trend as well called the woke police. Sila naman yung nakaka-trigger sa comment section natin. When you hear about, um, you know, those people that, okay, so this is something that I experienced because pinatulong talaga to. So si, what's her name again? Um, si, I don't wanna call her Hippon Girl. What's her name again? I don't know her name. <laughs> Budol. Yeah, there you go. So Harleen. there's this, there, yeah, there's yeah. this photo of Harleen Um, Boodle who were who was like decked out like really good makeup pero naka in afro yung buhok niya ayan in afro yung ah, buhok niya alam ko na mm-hmm. so sabi ko for me it was really beautiful it was the, the photography was really done well Harleen is look fierce on that photo it's really really good pero yung mga pawoke police <clears throat> Um, literally obliterated her comment section saying na parang cultural appropri- um, appropriation daw, dapat daw hindi siya nagkukulot, dapat daw ganyan, ganyan, ganyan. Sabi ko, those are called police, um, woke police. Don, yun yung mga tipong, uh, hindi, hindi nyo nga alam ang spelling appropriation, tapos... <laughs> Tapos, Kaya nga hindi ko kayo comment yan. Baka yung grammarly, mga ina. Oo, pero ang sabi ko, ang, ang comment ko naman, well, first and foremost, we need to backtrack. Okay, tama yung sinasabi nyo, baka nga mamaya cultural appro- appropriation yan. However, kung pinag-aralan natin ang history natin, negritos tayo. So we have the right to yes. have those curls. Because we are all made, I mean, we were we came from negritos. Mm-hmm. Filipinos yes. came from Negritos and that should be fine as well. Pero oh. syempre, mga pawok nga, parang dapat kasi ganito, ganito, ganyan, ganyan. And I'm like, girl, read your history first. Before you comment yeah. on a cultural appropriation, read your history first. Because galing tayo, galing ang, sabi ko nga, ang Negritos natin walked from Africa to here in yeah. the Philippines. So that means okay. we have all the right in the world to do the curly hairs, to do the cornrows and stuff like that because we yeah. share their blood. Regardless on how far removed our our culture is, we share mm-hmm. that common blood. However, yung mga woke police would not let it pass. Care to comment on that? <laughs> <clears throat> There's a fine line kasi between ano, um, criticism and stupidity. Oh, oh, oh diba? Kasi minsan, yung uh, what they call... Um, just saying or being real. Uh-huh, Nasa uh-huh. na pagiging tao mo dun sa part na yun eh. When you throw those comments, ikaw ba nagpapaka uh, ano, nagpapaka woke? 
gagaling-galingan or you really want to um, impart something. Kasi yun yung responsibility dapat sa social media. When you put it out there, oh talaga namang ano, you're putting yourself to everyone. Pero ganun din naman yung comment mo. So, Totoo. yung medyo wag tayong tactless. Oo, oh, oh, tactless. Oo. Oh, oh. Ikaw, Tenshi. Madalas yan, nakikita ko din yung mga magko-comment na tungkol sa mga fashion show, mga clothing ng ibang bansa, you know, um, mga nagko-costume, na wag daw mag cowboys and Indians, other mm-hmm. stuff like that. Naintindihan ko yon, Kasi, kung yung mismong may kultura nun, ayaw, they go. Mm-mm. Kasi merong, may, meron din namang mga cultures, like, minang J-pop. Gusto rin ng, like, for me, um, I see people who wear our Filipiniana, hindi ka ba matutuwa nun? Somebody's wearing the barong. Somebody's wearing the barot saya. They may be foreign, but I mean, if they wear it na to respect the culture, why not? If they oh. wear a kimono and they're happy wearing it. Kasi Japanese people have been asked, what is your take on people wearing the kimono? Oh, they're, they're happy. As long as, yun nga, may respeto, it's done right. Yun lang naman ang problema nila, parang yung leftover right, parang uh, uh, gawin nyo na lang ng tama. Other than that, they're mm-hmm. fine. Mm-hmm. Kasi ganun eh, parang na, 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 nagiging niche na ng mga pa-walk culture yung ganyang eksena na yung magninitpik sa lahat ng yan. So like for example, um, a lot of a lot of flock happened to Kim Kardashian about, you know, um cultural cultural appropriation okay. and black um blackface. Uh-huh. 'Di ba? Yang ganun yung blackface. Uh-huh. Like for example, and this again, that's it. I think this is the reason why Kim I we've never really heard anything from Kim Kardashian about any of this and she doesn't really give a flying fuck what other yeah. people say. It's because people like this. Wait, hold on. So, yun. Um, people, people don't see it that, like, for example, for Vogue magazine, um, before Kim Kardashian comes into that shoot, she's given an outfit, she, binigyan siya ng makeup artist, binigyan siya ng hairstylist, right? Kim Kardashian didn't decide, okay, magpa-blackface po ako. Paitimin, uh, sorry. Paitimin nyo ako, lagyan nyo ko ng cornrows. Okay? Kim Kardashian didn't decide that. Yes. Okay? It was the photographer. It was the designers. It was the um, photoshoot coordinator. It's the magazine itself. Pero binibili pa rin lang yung Vogue. Pero they want to hate on other artists. However, they don't understand na inutusan lang yung taong yan. Inutusan lang yan na ito ang ito yung makeup mo nilagyan siya ng makeup ito yung buhok mo ito yung costume design tumayo ka diyan pipicturean ka period wala there's merely at least there's no chance in hell like even for me not for everyone actually if Vogue magazine decided to say hey i want you in the front cover you will say yes regardless of what's happening <laughs> regardless kung ano sabi gusto niyo ako gusto niyo kumakain ako ng tae go kakain ako ng tae <laughs> because you know it's it's such a prestigious web um magazine so for people to, to hate on Kim Kardashian about it eh syempre bago pa again pagkatapos ni Kim Kardashian photographer makeup artist hairstylist tapos may mayroong mag uh, magazine editor creative team yan eh oh, oh. tapos huli pa si may huli pang Anna Winter Mm-mm. Bago pa yan ma-publish, ang dami nang nag-approve niyan. So, bakit si Kim Kardashian ang pag-iinitan nyo? I don't uh, get it. Jazz, you were saying something. Ano, uh, again, I'll go back sa ano, uh, own per- perception eh. Kasi, mm-hmm. yun yung perception ng uh, creative team, pero i- iba mo siya gustong tingnan eh. Mm-hmm. So, ikaw may problema. Yes. Diba? So, yun, we go back na sana open tayo sa ideas ng iba. If we want our um, opinions also to be respected, so you have to respect them as well. So, siguro choices of words tayo sa pagka-criticize para, kasi nga, again, may borderline tayo. Parang ano foundation nila minsan, may borderline. Kawang. May demarcation. Mo. <laughs> Totoo naman. Ano? Totoo naman yan. Ano mo, kimchi, tsaka si ano. 
Ganun, Vibration. Ganun, ganun, ganun. Ang hati, diba? ganun dito. Trick sa Mattel. Trick yun, <laughs> trick si. Parang, diba? okay. <laughs> also, yung ano, medyo nabubwisit kasi ako dyan yung ano, um, why people would uh, be tag cultural appro- appropriation dahil yung nagpapablock. Eh, paano yung mga black na nagpapableach ng buko? Yeah. Si Oli London, ano problema ni ano problema mo kay Oli London? Ah, yung ano, trip niya eh. Sige, magpawok na tayo, trip niya eh. Hindi ka naman, ano, inaano. Hindi ka naman siguro nasasaktan. Oo, so, oh, parang... hindi mo naman pera yun. Tatro. Parang ganun lang. Kung baga parang, again, I kind of want to understand the, that culture. Because there are times that it's really, like, again, si Oli London, speaking of cultural appropriation, hala, ngayon, <laughs> Trans... Ano, ano na ba siya ngayon? Transform. Transformer. Ganon. <laughs> <Inter> <laughs> parang, di ba, parang transnational na siya. Kasi, he was, bo- apparently, he was born British, but his heart is Korean. I'm like, hmm? huh? <laughs> Alam mo, parang, sometimes we have to draw a line because people like Oli London will take advantage of all of this kind of things. This, like, yung pagiging walk ni Oli London, I love it that we are dropping his name. <laughs> it's, like, it's just such a, it, it's it's an excuse for them. Eh. The woke culture is an excuse for them to do things that are not appropriate. Like, for example, <laughs> there's this, um there's this as well term, toxic positivity. Na parang sa sobrang woke mo na, nagiging toxic na yung pagkatao mo. One, sure. one of the signs of being um, a toxic positive person is you're literally dismissing all the negative thoughts na pumapasok sa... Like, anything na negative na nakikita mo, mali na agad. If it doesn't mm-hmm. apply to your life, mali na agad. Like, for example, um and this is... Um, how do you call that? Coming from... What's his name again? Steve Harvey. So, si Steve Harvey is clearly a black, a big black man, okay? Yeah. So, and he loves his meat, diba? So, one time daw, umuwi yung mga anak niya from their work, bumisita daw sa house niya. And they were like, why are you eating meat and stuff like that? Parang sabi oh. daw ni Steve Harvey, baka nakakalimutan nyo, bago pa kayo maging vegan, yan ang kinakain mo. So, don't, alam mo yung parang, don't push your agenda because you are now woke and you're, you're, you're now a vegan, na baka ba pangdidirian mo yung isang bagay na nagpalamon sa'yo noon, na bumuhay sa'yo noon. Sure. Oo. Diba? I mean, you can keep it to yourself. Sure. Pwede mo naman pandirian, pero wag mong sa harapan ng taong nagsaserve sa'yo, oh. sasabihin mo, parang, bata ka lang naman. I- 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 offensive na yon, Offensive na yon oh. Yung mga ganyan. Ano pa? Um, okay. Everything happens for a reason. <laughs> This is one um, toxic um, positivity that I am clearly not, you know, not, not really happy about because like, lagi na lang yun ang sinasabi nila. Like, um, um, it, everything happens. Kahit na mali na yung ginawa nila, kahit na nagkandaletso-letso na yung buhay nila, everything happens for a reason. Bitch, you didn't do anything. That's the reason why it's... Sorry na. <laughs> Ay, amen. Ganyan yung mindset ko eh. Nangyari to kasi kailangan siya mangyari. So, teach no, 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 niya no. lesson. No. It, it doesn't it doesn't work. Ah, okay. ka, ka, kasi kasunod niyan kasi, kasunod niyan kasi, it could be worse. You so okay. magkasunod na kasi yun eh. Magkasunod uh, na yun. Na parang yun yung hindi maganda. Everything okay. happens for a reason and it could be worse. Like well, someone could die. <laughs> That oh, ano yun, yun yung worse, <laughs> 'di ba? I think at least, 'di ba? Parang you, you cannot this miss the fault that happened around your decision making. Right? So that that's why you don't say um Everything happens for a reason. Look at the bright side. What bright side? <laughs> <laughs> Nagdidilim na nga yung paningin ko. Bright side ka pa rin. Totoo ba? Those, those, those things kasi are dismissive of the negative things around it. Like for example, mm-hmm. um, you're feeling down already. Halimbawa, ikaw, Tessico, you're going through shit. Literally. Uh, yeah. Tapos, sinasasabihin sa'yo ng mga kaibigan mo, ng mga co-workers mo, just look at the bright side. Diba? It could Pasalamat be worse. Pasalamat ka pa. Well, alam mo, yun, pasalamat ka pa. Oh my God. Ayoko na. Pababoy na tayo ng pababoy. Diba? Parang gano'n. Diba? Parang, hindi ko to. Oh, it, it shouldn't be like that. It, it needs to be, there needs to be a space for you in your life na 
may mali. Kailangan mong baguhin yung mali. So you cannot just say, look at the bright side. You cannot just say, everything happens in uh, for mm-hmm. a reason. It all works out at the end. No. It doesn't It doesn't really happen like that. You know, yung parang why not, um, instead of saying that, parang what can I do next time so I don't feel the same way or I don't get myself to be in that position again. Exactly. Diba? That's actually a way better um kasi di ba parang sinasabi nga nila sa coaching 101 um you don't i you 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 identify what's the problem and okay. work on it yes. para mag-improve. But if yes. you're continually going to be saying it could be worse, everything will work out at the end, everything happens for a reason, let's just say that. <laughs> Tanggapin na lang natin. Oo, yan ganyan. Tanggapin natin yan. <laughs> Oo, di ba? O kaya, ang worst ay... Ano daw? <laughs> Wala ka bigla. Ipasa Diyos na lang. Oo, ipasa Diyos na lang. No, sa pa din yan. Nakatrigger na trigger daw. Di ba? Parang idinamay niyo pa siya. Nananahimik si God. Di ba? Idinamay. <laughs> Nananahimik po ang greater powers that be. <laughs> Choice niyo po yan. Hindi kanila. No? <laughs> yun, yun ang kaloob. Ganon. Oh, yun ang ayaw na ayaw. Oh, kailangan kasi talaga. It needs to be... Uh, there, again, like what I said, there should be a, a space in your life that you should identify what you did wrong and correct it rather than ipagpasadyos nyo na or everything happened for a reason or uh, it could be worse look at the bright side girl if you kasi pag sinasabi mo kasi yan kinakancel out mo yung you. things that you can improve on true because you did not identify kung ano yung tama ay yung mali mong ginawa Right. And in a way, parang ini-invalidate mo yung feelings ng tao na malungkot siya. Mm-mm. So, again, mali na nang... Tama. Kaya nga, kaya... Kasi alam ko yung walk mother, ginagamit yun sa Chinese cooking niya. Eh. Hi! Uh... Oo, oh, yun, he- walk hey. Sarap kayo pag may walk hey talaga. Na. Siyempre, hindi alam ni Tenji ko yun kasi hindi nagluluto si Baka. Alam ko yun. Lagi nga sinasabi yun ni, ano yun. Ni? Ni Uncle Roger. <laughs> you walk okay. Yes. You see that walk? Uh-oh. Oh, you should um, have walk okay. Speaking of Uncle Roger, um, meron din siyang times na pa-walk eh. Like, for example, yung ah. isang series niya, no, um, a guy ordered something vegetarian. Tapos kinansel uh-huh. at you should be eating meat eh. Enjoy your grass. Parang, bad. <laughs> He's a comedian though. I mean... Yun na nga, pero... Pero yun nga, I mean... Gusto tayo. May, may ano nga, may, 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 may fine line. Na, may fine line nga. Yung, okay na tayo dun sa ano, i-offer mo na lang, pero instead, si Bokul mo. Hindi kasi, I mean, I get, I get the, un, I get the comedy. Okay, I really do get the comedy. So, meron din itong, um, and I'm not, I'm not, how do you call that, targeting this sect or this religion, ha? Huh? Para, de, meron din kasi yung Christian community. Yon, that's that's uh, na na medyo um, attacking the other lifestyle. Like for example, um, I can remember the, the the. I'm happy that I can't remember the page though. Hold on. Um, let me find the. Is that you? Hindi. Meron kasi sa YouTube na meron siyang si Trixie Mattel is reacting to them. I just can't remember what. <clears throat> na parang mm. na yung ano parang um uh, oversexualized daw ang ang gay community, ang drug community. So may may ganun eh. I just, oh, hold on. Let me. Well, it's drag. It's exaggerated femaleism. I don't know. Ayun, ganun ang tawag dito. Wait. Girl defined. Yun yung kanyang ganun. Yun yung kanyang um uh, yun yung page ng babae ng mga babae na parang hmm. this is what the bible say or think or do dapat ito lang yung ganun i don't know it's just it's just such a weird thing for hmm. you know um something so something so innocent right like christianity could be as innocent as you want to be and could be righteous as they want to be however to attack something that you have no idea about and call it something else it's, true it, it's it, 
alam mo parang yun it's 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 a it's a form of cult um it's a form of woke culture that hindi natin malabanan because they because unfortunately we in a certain level believe their the, the 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 saying of the bible like for example me i may not be a practicing catholic but i know what the bible says so minsan pag halimbawa naggagan para papagod ako hindi na parang ayoko nang makipaglaban sa inyo kasi parang kung ano lang yung nag a sa gusto nyo sabihin yun lang talaga yung binabasa nyo and stuff and and you know and and then like yung level of understanding nila eh. so oo di ba so medyo medyo nakakalungkot because again Christianity can be as innocent as it is right True. but unfortunately may mga tao na toxic talaga sila na nandiyan sila sa buhay natin and they are going to just you know damage everything um, in recent conversations like um this was like there's a movie that's been out that's how do you call that been released here in the Philippines i just can't remember what but um MTRCB originally said okay with it ah. and then when Robin Padilla saw it oo oh, oh. He oh, said down that um the Philippines was not to allow it. Yeah, because mm-hmm. it the Philippines is being drawn to, in a very negative way. How do you feel about that? Because personally, it should be okay provided that you know you we have to provide um leeway for entertainment and imagination. Mm-hmm. How do you think is, about that though? Is that the one with the you no know, si Tom Holland? No, no. Not, not that. Ah, that, that No, 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 no wait. Parang they were picturing, painting the Philippines in a different way. Parang uh, part of China. Ganon. Di, 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 di. di. Sanya, inahanap. Nakita ko yung kanina sa Reddit. Local ba yun? No, it's not. Hindi, US film. Ah, US na, film. Na, ano pangalan nun? Pero o, eh, siya eh. Si Robin, let's go back to ano, his reaction nung sa Pilipinas Got Talent. Ah, oh, oh. Ah, yun, diba plain. Japanese guy. Yun plain, plain by um. Yun plain. What's his name again? Um, si ganon si I can't remember his name though. Who's this guy again? Wait. Gerald Butler. There you go. Gerald Butler. Oh. Yeah. So Hi. there's this. Yeah. So ako naman kasi like again like if we are going to be pawok on that you know like because again we're going back we're going back to um. We just we're just too sensitive right now. Like everything that people do is wrong. Mm. Like, because if ever that's gonna, that's gonna happen, dapat um Japan would have already attacked us before. Because parang ila after ng World War Three, ng yeah, every kalaban here in the Philippines is like the Japanese, right? So we, we should have been attacked again, right? Mm. Or um. In the US, matagal na dapat nagpatayan ng US at Russia kasi every movie ng ng US, US. before is laging Russia ang kalaban, right? So it has to uh, a lot of people need to give a small leeway on entertainment and imagination to to thrive. Ang hirap naman na parang hin, parang porket ba na, nalagay sa ganung imahe ang Pilipinas, ganun ba talaga Pilipinas hindi naman, 'di ba? True. What do you guys think about that? Because it's just well, Robin. Uh, uh, Robin is just really rubbing me the wrong way lately. So. Oh, Robin. <laughs> Not that kind of rubbing. <laughs> ah, okay. Hey, also, diba? mm-mm. Asi gigo bi. Hindi kasi aside from that, ano? Aside from being just sensitive to everything, bakit hindi natin tignan yon as room for improvement? Because I mean. Apparently, it's happening. Like, why yeah. not investigate if it really is happening or not? Diba? It's so true. Because it's OA. Like, okay, let's try to find other countries. But we also have a local version. When you say it's from Tondo, you know. Yes, yes. How do they paint people from Tondo in the movies? Ay, oo, may nakita nila sa Reddit noon yung diba? napaka-racist natin even locally. Na yeah. pati-saya, ganyan. Mm-hmm. Oh. Na pag-ilokano, ganyan. Parang, bakit nga ba? Eh, so, baka like... nakakalimutan ni Robin, meron tayong artist exemption, di ba? Oh, oh, there's always... Even sa grammar yeah, and the likes. Oh, oh. I'm down on bended knees, di ba? Exempted siya sa ano, kasi hindi naman siya... My God, Robin. Charot. Si Batman. Kasi kasi parang ako ha, there's 
in this woke culture that we currently are in right now, it's well and good. It's really good in a way that a lot of people are now recognizing things that should have been recognized way, way, way before. Mm-hmm. However, parang again going back to the how do you call it to the woke police or in other terms they are called the keyboard warriors. Na parang lahat na lang magiging malaking issue. Kasi oh. and and it's so funny because it they don't allow improvement if they don't allow um anything that doesn't that they don't allow their uh, that is true. out of their you know their, their preferences wala lang parang doon lang ako nadi depressed kasi parang sayang yung opportunity now that we have it mm parang uh, ano agad eh you can sit with us ganun oo and at saka yung pa yung ayo ko yung we call each other bobo na ngayon dahil lang hindi siya nag-agree sa opinion mo ano bobo na lahat. Yan, wala na matalino. Hindi ba, oh. isara na lahat ng school. Hindi daw pwede. Mag-ROTC pa sila. Huwag ka magulo. Oo nga. Oh, kasi... Namimiss ko yun. Charot. <laughs> Not for everyone because you know, I don't really do that. Exempted ako. Mm. Kami ni Sam, exempted. <laughs> Hindi din mo na ako nag- <laughs> nag-ROTC ako. Kaso, dun ako nilagay sa admin. Ay? Okay nga yun. So, okay tulad lang. Di, eh, nakakapagod mag, eh, mag input input ng... Ng ano? Si Jazz, Very, mas, mas gusto ang physical. Ako, oh, 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 mas physical ang mm. pagkataon niya. Pag, pagdating, clearly, pagdating sa brain, medyo... <laughs> Oo. Oh, oh. ka nung... <laughs> Hindi nakapag-gym yung brain natin. Charot. Hindi kasi, like, again, um, going back ha. And there are things that um, a lot of people are commenting about because they think that okay um the people that are now masyadong pa pa health buff yeah pa health buff tayo katulad ganyan and they're hating on Lizzo for showing bo- body positivity what do you think about that? let there's room for everybody just just say <laughs> that but what do you guys think about kasi ako personally there is a thin line that Lizzo is mm. bordering okay lang maging obese you know pero he, he, mm. she, she needs to reel it in as well din naman in a, in a certain level because like yeah we know that you're big and you're proud of it and we're okay with that but you don't have to wear those clothes na parang kulang mabuti na lang mm. talaga magaling yung body makeup mo dahil kung hindi kita talaga yung pinaglabanan ng catwoman at yung ano Garfield sa kamot oo oh, oh. at saka <laughs> Enough na kasi ako dun sa ano, everyone is beautiful, everyone is sexy in our own way. Parang prostitution na kasi ang ano, pinipaint nila eh. True. Totoo. Parang diba? kasi napipi, na, na, nagagano na siya eh. Parang hindi na siya healthy tingnan because um, now everyone is like, uh, how do you call that? Parang hindi na siya... Larry? Oo. Hindi ko baga pa... Hindi eh. May, I mean, hindi na siya healthy tingnan because my standard is different than yours and my standard is better than yours. And that's... Mm. Like, yun ang nakaka um, actually nakakapanic I mean Kasi, okay lang sa, siguro kung like let's say malaki talaga siyang babae kahit mag exercise siya wala nang ililiit uh, so that's uh, fine uh, uh, pero if someone is already big not even trying to do anything about it I would be concerned for their health uh-uh. <laughs> like, <laughs> us. <laughs> like us like yeah. us <laughs> I'm concerned for myself too. So parang do something about it. Kasi naman, oo, oh, okay lang ako, okay lang ako. Maganda ako. Okay, so, maganda ka. Kakain ako pa rin nakakain, parang ganon. Oo, yung parang medyo disiplina, hindi natin ang ating mga tao. Okay, uh, okay, like for example, and um, uh, how do you call that? So, I'm fat, I'm fat, right? And people say that, kailangan mag- it, But you have to you have to let them understand na and this is something that I've experienced as well even before na parang people would call me alam mo Sam ganun mamamatay ka sa pagyoyosi mo ganyan ganyan girl I already know that you don't have to tell mm. me I'm well aware sa so, so packaging <laughs> natin ng ano uh-huh. you don't have to tell me that so parang sabi nga nila don't parang don't tell smokers that they're going to die they already no, know no. that and they're there's true and some something is already killing them inside mm-hmm. so you have to be very careful so for example if you are fat like for example i am now you don't have to tell me that i'm fat i know that it's not like hindi ako nag, hindi nang galing sa 28 yung bewang ko 
It's just that for me, it's hard for me to come back to to where it was before. Mm. Secondly, I don't really care that much anymore. I try to, to be active. I still try to be active. Eh si Lizo, putang ina, hindi na nga active. Lala na nga lang, lala sa... Lala ano, ano, Tapos super two-piece pa rin na two-piece. Hmm. Ito pa! Ito na, bumalik tayo doon sa Christian world na pinag-uusapan natin last night before we got um disrespectfully interrup- interrupted. <laughs> And what do you guys think about the unholy performance of Sam Smith? Wait, ganito na lang sa akin, mother. I'd rather um, hear Sam Smith sing than watch him. Bakit I know, I know that he just came out, talagang announced to everyone that he's gay, but it's too much for me. Yung, it's too much. Mm-hmm. I don't know. For me lang naman. Oh, ikaw, ikaw, Tenshi. Hindi ko alam kung ano yun. <laughs> Because she came, the, the bitch came out in full red. Tapos may nakatap hat siya na may horns. So people say yeah. that, you know, it's the devil coming out. Well, the song is unholy, so what did you expect? The funny thing um, is there yeah. is that and a lot of people, ako ha, in a certain level, tama ka just, um, it's just a little bit too much for me. However, if that's how he wants to do it, fine, that's fine with me. Mm. It's just that he's getting flack because Um, yun nga, parang devil incarnate na daw siya, bakit daw ganyan, ganyan. Meanwhile, nung si, si Christina Aguilera at si, aba si Britney Spears at si Madonna ang naglaplapan, they're okay. Mm. Pero yeah, when, one-sided. When, when Sam Smith turned, turned it there, gano'n na siya, devil incarnate. Tsaka yung ano, yung kay Miley Cyrus, yung nag-ganyan siya. Kay, siya ano, oh. Oo. Oh, oh. She got black too. Parang bakit ganon? There are certain people who have a past and those True. other people don't. Mm-hmm. You know what I'm saying? Because parang you have to. There is. Parang sabi, parang sabi ko eh, parang um, before um, si Lady Gaga lumabas na nagbuka siyang alien, okay lang. <laughs> may sungay siya dito, may sungay siya dito, uh-huh. okay lang. But because it's Lady Gaga, but because it's Sam Smith, there's a problem. Uh-huh. Yeah, he he wasn't like that before. Oh, so people oh. were used to it. I'm like, mm. it's just like it's it's. it's Pero to call him devil because of the costume. So and dami pa lang ano, dem- and dami pa lang demonic ano, every, lalo pag Halloween, di ba? True. Pero sa pre, nalulunod na lamang yung mga Christian purist na people ah. that you know, yung mga tipong and as well those people that is just plainly bigot, di ba? Yeah. Yung mga, yan yung mga tinatawag kong type amen people. Mm-mm. Diba? Sa so parang hindi ko maintindihan kung sa Parang gusto ko may bangs ako. <laughs> parang bet nga mother. Bangs. Try mo. Parang check ang bangs. Huwag naman, huwag naman eros bangs. Hindi <laughs> naman. Na. Ganun na. Ano to dito? Parang hmm. wala lang. Baby bangs lang Nakatutong, talaga. Nakatutong ka ba? Hindi. Ilaw lang yan talaga dito sa ah, Sabi ko, ang Or, galing naman ng artist. Hindi ba? Kala ganyan talaga lang yun. Maputi lang, maputi lang talaga yung pinakadulo kasi yung siya yung pinakamatagal na bleach itong mga to. Mm-hmm. Diba? Ganun talaga siya. So, anyway. Two, Maka siyang balayage. Two-tone. Fairer. Charin. So yun nga. Yung ano. Ah, ano pa? Mm. Magbigay kayo, magbigay yung, ko ng example. Example ko naman is ano, um, you're, ne- uh, you're never too old. You'll always be uh, young at heart. Pero pag makikita mo yung old days, nagdadamit ng the usual nilang damit ng mga bata pa sila. Parang pinandidirihan, gano'n, parang ano ba yan? Ang tanda-tanda na yan, parang yung ibagay naman. Pero pag sila naman nagsuot, na kailangan age-appropriate yung suot. Age-appropriate, oh, yung age-appropriate suot. naman. Parang, Me, hindi nga ako sila, I don't care. <laughs> parang, <laughs> Kasi nasabihan na ako niyan, may friend ako na sabi, ano ba yung trip mong suot? Parang, ang tanda mo na, yan pa rin trip mo. Parang, ay, oh, oh, parang, Ko, eh, this is my, di ba? This is my way of expressing my, my, myself, di ba? Sa clothes, so, pakay mo, baka di mo lang afford, ganun. Well, ako Chaka-chaka. naman, parang, I don't know. My take on that is that, it's it's just that, you need to, um how do you call that? You're, it's okay to wear whatever you want. That's fine. It's just that you need to, you need to find a space or a place for it. Like for example, mm. and I'm telling you this, kasi nangyari ka nga sa akin, nangyari ka sa akin, whilst I was in Singapore, na nasyak ako na naka, naka, naka tank tap at naka pek pek shirt si, naka, naka bra sports, naka sports bra, naka pek pek shirt si Lola, nasa sa Starbucks, sa, sa Vivo Center. E, baka kagagaling nila ng gym. Charot. I can't understand, but there's no gym on that location. 
Alam mo yun, yung parang... Baka nainitan si mother ko, ma'am. Oo, oh, it's too hot and SG, gano'n. It's too laban... hot and I'm hot too, gano'n. Labanan na lang ng gano'n, <laughs> labanan na lang ng lakas ng loob. Okay lang naman yun sa akin. Again, there's room for everybody, let's just say that. Mm-hmm. But, Kaso. But just, syempre, i- ilalugay natin, okay lang naman kasi yun eh. Uh-huh. Again, there's no... We're, we're, we're in a... We're, what we need to understand right now in this conversation is that there's it's okay whatever you want to do but you have to still identify kung ano yung kailangan mong i-correct uh-huh. kung ano pa rin yung kailangan nating i-improve kasi then, for me yung mga woke woke I uh-huh. love the intent kasi of educating correcting pero how they do it yun yung ayoko yung parang minamaliit min, minamaliit yung tao eh yung gano'n, yung parang lahat ng pawok galit. Kailan galit? <laughs> Bakit naman galit? Diba? Meron yung, meron yung parang... talagang galit nga yun. Oh, diba? Ogo, oh, continue. And ang nakakatakot doon is, we might have the, um, sa akin lang to, the vice ganda um, oh. result. Kasi ba diba, before, we were all um, fond of vice ganda's jokes. Now, when the kids were answering their teachers the way vice ganda would um, answer, hindi na pala siya nakakatuwa. Diba yung pilosopo na yung mga pagsagot ng bata? Oh, sarcastic. Oh, 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 oh. Sarcastic na. So, everyone's sarcastic. So, itong pagiging pawok natin, okay. Tapos lahat magiging pawok na. So, kagulo na naman tayo. And... I'm, just, I'm just glad that I'm nearing death already. So, I'm not gonna really care about what's gonna... <laughs> what's about to happen. Kasi para... Kaharting ka ng dying. Kasi, nandun na yung maganda na yung intent. Eh. Educating and stuff ganun. Yung, yung, yung yun na nga yung pinakamasaknap doon is just that um yung mga woke people they they're such in a hurry to correct mm-hmm. na parang mm-hmm. again we need to allow things to be corrected properly. Properly. Basta na lang na natin i-dismiss yung everything else because this is oh. what I think to do. Which is like bro at it again and again and again, nakakapagod kayo mga bakla kayo. Tiyara, bakla lang talaga. <laughs> diba? Kasi there are some Ay, cultures um, na uh, they picture out women, pag nagkaroon ng menstruation, they are the, at the, their dirtiest um, state pag may menstruation. So, hindi mo naman pwedeng ituro sa kanila na ito na po kasi yung ngayon eh. Hindi mo naman maipapaliwanag eh. Kasi that's their tradition. It takes time to, ano, to accept new things. So, Pero give it time. Pero depende siguro. Kasi merong ibang culture na yun nga. Ang tingin pag may menstruation. Sabagay, tribo yun. Mm-hmm. Lalagay ka sa hot, di ba? Sa hot. Alam mo, oo, parang uh-huh. doon na siya. Walang pakialam sa'yo, parang kahit matagig ka pa. Oo. Uh-huh. Wait lang. Tao yun. So, <laughs> so yun nga, eh, hindi madaling ano yun yung mga yeah. nakasatayan. Pero give it time. Give it time. And do it nicely. There's an option naman, there's always an option to be nice about with what you're doing. Eh. It's just that, again, doon tayo pumupunta sa, um, sa um, toxic positivity na parang, yeah, we know that it's the, the, the right thing to do, but it's just that you can shove it on their faces. It just doesn't happen that way. Now look at that guy who wanted to spread Christianity in the Sentinel Island. He's dead now. Who's that? Who there's this Christian? Mormon guy. This is more because diba, the Sentinel Island, you're not allowed to step foot on it as declared by the world. Because there's a tribe that refuses uh, to, uh, no. that's the one near India. Okay, okay. yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. So this Mormon guy tried to uh, no, preach. Hindi nga na siya nakapag preach because tag is not. Oh, girl. Diba? So yun, yun yung best Wala example. Room for na. everybody. Uh-uh. To <laughs> so respect na ayaw nila. Sa true. Masyado na puno yung room nila kaya ayaw na nila papasukan ng kahit asina. There's no room for everyone anymore. Mm-hmm. Kaya let's, kaya ano din, for me, again, keep an open mind that there are those people na ayaw talagang kumanig sa opinion mo. Ganun. So, let it be. Ano na kayong saying, mother, yung let, ayun, let's agree to disagree na lang. Yun yun, yun, yun yun. But, again yeah. ha, going back to where where that con- that kind of notes or that those ca- those kind of quotes are not anymore applicable properly or used properly pala like mm-hmm. to disagree is 
a super grave space right now. Not any, it's not anymore. Like, really? I, ako, yeah, no, because like for example, and this happened to me, and you know this. Kasi di ba, parang okay, ano? yun nga yung sinasabi niya na <laughs> let's agree to disagree and stuff like that. I'm okay with it. But mm-hmm. there should be a room for a conversation and do not shove everything down the drain mm-hmm. that line of agree to disagree. Agree to disagree. Yeah. Mm-hmm. If you've already done something negative just because of your belief and you just say, eh, let's just agree to disagree. So you're telling me na okay lang na pinagmumura mo ako na ginawa sinabi mo ako tinawag tinawag mo akong bobo okay lang din na no that's not fair mm-hmm. again so may ano na naman tayo doon there's always an exemption to the octet rule True. there's always a, no there's there's it's not an exemption it's an expectation expectation so, if there is a disagreement regardless if you agree to disagree there should still be a, a place or a space where you're going to acknowledge things that you've done whilst you're doing the disagreement. Mm, true. I never forget to apologize. If you hurt someone, ganun. Hindi siya masakit yung mag-apologize din. Oo, yun din kumalika, yung... Kumalika, kumalika. Yun yung ano, napapansin ko din sa mga keyboard warriors. Parang um, batukan sila ng facts, facts. Okay, wala talaga umaamin na ano, nagkasakitan sila dahil sa pinaglalaban nila. Mm. That's the saddest part lang sa woke culture ngayon. Tapos ano, para silang networking ano, nangre-recruit talaga ng mga kaibigan. Totoo. Totoo. Yung tipong ganun Hello. pa yung 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 magtatag pa ng mga mga kakronis nila. Oo. Yung para, oy, tingnan mo to. Ganon. Tapos okay. ire-report yung account, ganun-ganun para Ano tayo eh, bata? O oh, di ba para hindi niya talaga kaya kasi bakit umuabot tayo sa ganun? Hindi niya kaya yung intellectual level ng ano. Hmm. Buti na lang hindi ako umabot doon sa intellectual level. <laughs> that didn't come from me, girl. That didn't come from me. O siya, yun na lang. Yeah. I-wrap up na natin ito kasi nakakagano na. Um, it's just that we want to continually talk about this conversation. And we want to continually learn about things. And speaking of learning, Next week, BDSM huh? mode tayo with a few oh my of my God. friends that finally agreed. So, oh my God. that's really exciting. I mean, I hope that you guys are would stay tuned for that because we oh have a my God. Oh, I miss someone. In. Shut up. <laughs> <laughs> Alright, so, um, uh, again, this is a cup of coffee podcast saying thank you to a lot of our uh, listeners across weirdly enough dumadami pa rin kayo so I don't know what's your priorities and why a cup of coffee is a part of your <laughs> but that's the, probably they just want to think normal oh uh, for people not to think uh, uh, that's the reason I'm asking bak- bakit ang weird ang mga tao to dumadami pa rin yung yung listeners natin pero hindi naman ayaw mo ba No, it's share okay. kasi ako dapat sa Reddit. I think I shared to a few people in Reddit. It's okay, it's of just, all places. It's, it's like it's it's I, weird that you know. Kasi pati I think um, those, these listeners probably mother are just like us. They have questions that they cannot ask. Kasi nga nand kasi yung mga pawaw kaya baka malait ako. True, totoo ka. So, Anyways, thank you. Thank you so much, guys. And enjoy Bye. the rest of your night. Good night, guys. Good night. Chop, chop, chop. Bukas na. Charot. A Cup of Coffee podcast is available on Spotify, Apple Podcasts, and now on video format on YouTube. Just search A Cup of Coffee podcast. Follow us on our socials, Instagram and TikTok where we have clips and teasers about the upcoming episodes. Don't forget to follow and subscribe to A Cup of Coffee Podcast. A Cup of Coffee Podcast is powered by Mama Sam Media.